Hi 3D printer fanatics, I'm Frank from Frank's 3D Shop and today let's burn some PLA. Okay, my thinking behind this is I'm gonna do some cases for electronic project and I want to know if the PLA will catch on fire. That, that's, that's my question. And I could go on the internet and look at some YouTube, but what's the fun in that? I'm gonna try to burn some PLA. Let's come with me. So let's see if it will burn. Let's try to put it on fire. Nope. Mmm. I like the smell of PLA in the morning. I love the smell of napalm in the morning. It's burning. Yeah, it's burning. Burns like a candle. So if so, if the temperature is high enough, it can ignite. Ow! Yep, <laughs> it's burning. smells kind of good doesn't smoke much but it's burning it's burning it's burning what a surprise <laughs> I didn't think it will burn this, this well Wow and the cat is curious <laughs> okay so it stopped burning so it burns, but it doesn't bur burn that well. It's kind of in the right condition without wind. It can burn. It sure can melt. Hi. <laughs> so it doesn't burn that well, but some people say that it burns like a candle. I have an idea. So let's see if it burns like a candle. Here's a candle. Here's a PLA candle. So in conclusion, uh, PLA doesn't ignite on itself easily, it doesn't burn easily, it doesn't even make a good candle. So I think it's safe to say that printing a case for an electronic project should be okay, as long as it's uh, low powered and not too much uh, heat coming from the circuit because PLA tends to uh, melt easily or at lower temperature than other plastic. As usual, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up if you like this video, and uh, see you in the next video. Ciao, bye!